So after a long time, there is a new update of a new custom home. The name is Evolution XOS version 7.4 is here with December security patch, of course. It doesn't include any major changes, by the way, but the changes which are included, I will talk about all those things in this video. So stay tuned. First of all, yes, this is Evolution XOS version 7.4 with December security patch officially available for some of the devices and if your device did not got the official build yet you will get very very soon this is what we have this is evolution x version 7.4 based on android 13 with the december security patch and some of the highlighted changes i'll talk about in this video the first change which we get here is in the screen recording the option is enable hevc it was not available previously, but with this new update, this option is included, which will use some more efficient HEVC video encoding. And this option is available in screen recording options. If you check out the screen recording option available in your quick settings panel, which is of course having the dark quick settings panel. Also moving on to the battery section, if you're able to notice, if I move on to the battery usage, you'll see you can now reset the stats, which is a very useful thing to be honest. And I think so it was not available in some previous builds, but with this new update, it's there. Well, with this chart, we'll show you the battery usage from the last full charge, not from the past 24 hours, which is available in some pixel based customs. It's based on pixel, but it does not include that feature. You also have the option to check out the battery temperature and the option which is having battery charge warning. This is quite good by the way. By the way, I made a comparison video on Evolution XOS versus Project Elixir. In the terms of UI, Project Elixir, it is a better choice. Although Evolution XOS is having a lot more features compared to Project Elixir, one more change which I found in this version is wake lock blocker. I think it was not available in the previous builds. What is this? If you enable this option, it will tell you how many wake locks your device is having. And this is maybe useful in your case and or if it is not useful, simply, simply ignore this thing. Don't use this if you don't know what you're doing. Because I wanted to tell you that which are the changes, which are the features included in this version. That is why I'm sharing you these things. And other than else, in this customer, we have some spoofing options regarding to unlimited photo storage, higher FPS in games, and also Netflix spoof, which is a very different kind of thing available in some of the custom rooms. By the way, it's there. By the way, in the terms of features and customizations, this custom home is having a lot like in developer options, like in miscellaneous developer options, we are having ignore window secure flags. This is a very useful thing, which will remove the screenshot and screen records limits from the devices uh, from the apps, which does not support that. Power menu has a very useful feature called disable power menu on lock screen. So if your device has secure lock screen, then you will not see this power menu. This is a very, very useful thing. Including this power menu feature, we also have some quick settings customizations like quick settings secure, quick setting tiles, we have auto brightness icon, we have quick settings footer warning, some animations, let me show you some animations here like flip. So if I enable this option, you'll see this kind of animation, which is actually not a feature, it's a customization thing. So if you love customizations, you might use this thing or you can simply ignore this thing too. Quick settings, footer customizations and clear all notification buttons. I don't think so it is having the quick setting transparency option. Um, if you use this thing, unfortunately, you will not love this thing. Notifications also having retigger customizations, retigger notifications, which is a replacement of heads up notifications, boring heads up notifications. If you love retigger style, you will love this thing too, and you will try to enable this option. Most likely every useful feature is included, so you will be able to use this custom on a device as your daily driver. In status bar, it is having the status bar lyric option, which is available in only some of the custom rooms and Evolution XOS is one of them. We are having this feature and to be honest, I don't use this feature much, but it's there. That is why I'm sharing with you. We have some icons customizations. In the terms of icon customization, some colored icons customizations or icons which you want in your status bar, you can simply enable or disable those. Including the status bar customizations which are included in this version, we also have some themes related things. In theming section, the custom color theming is missing from here. We have some options to customize some signal icons if you want to. We have icon pack customization, dark theme customizations, but custom color customization is not there. So if you need that, you can use Repainter for that. But else, this is all about today's short and simple video. I hope you like this. Link is available in the description. Thanks for watching and goodbye.